That intro might be a bit much. I don't know. <laughs> I just made that. Guys, how you doing today? Ooh, I don't know who that is. CR2 campaign, but I'll uh, I'll take it. <laughs> Let's play some freaking Harry Potter, man. I'm so excited for this. Oh yeah, I'm fabulous. That's right. Nope, not that. Look, look at him. Look at him go. Look how happy he is. What a happy boy. Guys, how you doing today? <laughs> Thanks, Julian. <laughs> I was trying a couple different songs. That's full disclosure. That's why I'm late today. I had to export that real quick. Oh, man. Okay. Oh, <laughs> we're going to play some games. So last time we got through the whole castle-y thing, or the dungeon thing with the sputers. And we're, what are we doing next? I got to get a broom, guys. I want one. So bad. Goodness, JK. <laughs> Julian, please do. I mean, don't. I can't. I can't condone that or endorse that. But um, I want people to be free here, you know. <laughs> but also, probably, I don't know. Up to you. <laughs> I'm not gonna tell you what to do. I'm just gonna tell this guy what to do. Oh, that's right. I did I had a, a thing. I told the lady about it. What am I doing right now? Okay, there's a there's a thing over here. A quest. Que nope. One of these buttons have a quest button. I know that for sure. There we go. Talents. Oh yeah. We got cool stuff afoot. <gasps> I'm getting a broom. <laughs> that's next. Are you serious? Freak yeah! I called it. I'm so excited. Okay, calm down, computer. Chill. We're gonna. We're. Uh, I should go this way. But the air the thing's over there. Fine. I'll follow you, light. Wait, I can teleport. What am I doing, guys? <laughs> the dodge thing with the spooters means nothing in this game. <laughs> oh, it's fair. Duck, yeah. Julian, that's an acceptable curse word all around. I love it. Um, okay, distracted maps. Listen, we gotta freaking fly. But waiting for this. That is, I've never explored this tower since then, really? That's, that's it? Fine. That's a walk. Star Chance, hi. How you doing? Oh, and also, hi Julian, hi Nevin, hi Adi. <laughs> or, A80? You know, I don't think I've ever known for sure. How do you say <laughs> your name? Oh yeah, I'm a wizard. Okay, I'm distracted. This way. Open up. Dude! I'm about to do that. Spoilers. I'm gonna get a freaking broom! I'm so excited! Hi, hi, hi. Wait. If you hear a dog in the background, it's my dog, not yours. Everybody grab a broom, and That's we right. shall get started. Duh. So excited. Mr. Clopton, your attention, please. Sorry, okay, Madam so. Kagawa. Everyone, please welcome a new Look student to Harry. our flying class. Hello. The goal of today is to remind all of you how to maneuver on a broomstick safely. <clears throat> as right. broom flight is, first and foremost, a means of transportation. This, I fear, some of you have forgotten. Diving, rolling, and loop-the-loops will not be taught or in fact tolerated in this class. Why not? We leave that to professional Quidditch players, like the Toyohashi Tengu. But I do I great it? flips. Now, let's see how well everyone kept up with their practice over the summer holidays. So good. For those who need a refresher, step up to your broom. Say up. Firmly and clearly, <laughs> fair, fair enough, I do. Then kick your leg over <laughs> and rest your weight on the seat. Bubba the Menace, welcome! You're just in time for me to get a brown! I seriously did not look this up. Thank I had no you. idea that this was going to happen before now, I named my stream while I ever get my broom. I just really wanted my broom. Up, up, up you up. stupid ratty school broom! I don't even say it. 
up. Uh, I want him just to do it without saying that'd be hilarious. One leg Here's over, try. so there's a leg on each side. None of that side saddle nonsense. A gust of wind will throw you right off. Well, I'd be more comfortable. But okay. Dude, that's the way to play, Boba. <laughs> I feel like I did the same thing. And if you hear my whistle while you're in flight, ground yourself I was at once. I whistle work it. Alrighty! Now, Kay. for your first lesson, fly Easy. through each ring in the courtyard. Easy. Kay. Do take care. <laughs> the booms this is are school property. Ah. I want them returned in one piece. I think piece. I'm getting the hang of this. I think you are too, Harry. I mean... Neil Baggins. <laughs> Sorry, it's totally Harry's voice. Well done. Now that you're acclimatized to your broom, let's see how well you manage with a more advanced exercise, shall I we? I was gonna say a more advanced broom. I was like, we get more? Dude, it's gotta be uncomfortable. Look at that. Like, this it's going through my skirt thing. We'll take you around <laughs> the grounds for more of a challenge. Okay. Where's? How do I do loop loops? I know you said I couldn't, but I wanna. <laughs> Wow! Nice day for a flight. You're a nice day for a flight, Burn. Uh -huh. Brilliant. I'm having a blast here. This is beautiful. Ah, <laughs> uh, the old boathouse. Wish you could have experienced crossing the lake as a first year. I do too. But you know what? You can't make a perfect game. <laughs> Can you? <clears throat> You can buy new ones? Oh heck yes. Whoa. I wanna go faster. <gasps> likes to make an appearance once in a while. Cthulhu? Oh. Is that you? Oh he makes noises. I wanna see. The music in this game is so good. That wasn't too bad. You yeah. So cool. Oh, well done. Dude, Have there were sports like Quidditch when I was growing up. Like, I'd be playing Quidditch, you know? I say, I watched you fly through those rings. You seem to handle yourself on that dusty school broom well enough. Don't talk about how I'd I imagine handle you're myself. ready for something a bit more challenging. Sure. But I'm getting ahead of myself. We haven't probably met. I'm Everett Clopton. Hi, Am Everett Clopton. Suspecting that a Hufflepuff like you might be interested in some high flying fun. Are you saying you want to do drugs after school? Sure. Can't say no to that. What did you have in mind? A bit of a detour, so to speak. Follow so me. to speak. Follow me. Let's go. The tour is about to begin. Okay. Follow closely now. Right I'm now, following we're you, sir. Over the Transfiguration Courtyard. I've Lovely never known a man. Be this Let's nerdy. hope the headmaster isn't having tea and I'm by friends the window with today. Bates. You should hear him talk about Doctor Who. It's it's a lot. Nice to get above it all, isn't it? It sure is. I forgot your name already. I'm not gonna lie. I'm sorry. Oh. Ahead of the gardens, the but you are a swell flyer and a great tour guide. I just want to say. My taste. This, I understand that. So How are you so fast? Here's something handy to know. Lean forward for a burst of speed. Helpful if you need to escape a tricky situation. Okay. Um, toggle flight speed. Speed burst. <laughs> now that's more like it. You sure you're not part hippogriff? Can I hold this or does it go? There's it goes the out. famous bridge. Think of all the magic holding it up. Put I will not. In. Look at it. And the owlery. That's a bit of solid architecture, isn't it? Sure Try is. And a jaunt around Hogwarts. This is quite the tall Everett. Seriously. Wow. An owl. That's the owl's whistle. This concludes our tour. Best hurry back. Yeah. Little flat low. Looks like she's already dismissed class. Better hurry and hand in our brooms. Do I have to? Dismount oh. <laughs> Landing is unavailable right now. I'm sorry I can't do it. No. <laughs> it's 
like I was on the fly all the time. Oh, hello, Professor. Mm -hmm. We were trying to get a bit of extra practice in. Hefty points will be taken from Yay. each of you for not following my instructions. Mr. Clopton, I am disappointed in you. You're in this class because you're still because you're still not showing yourself, <laughs> or frankly, your broom the proper respect. But Professor, enough. Class is finished for the day. Okay. It's my glasses. As for you. It? You do well to use better judgment in the future. I can't with this fancy hat. Chin up. That was some rather good flying. Well, thanks, ma'am. I forgot your name too. With the hat Sorry like about this. that business with Kagawa. You have, have to show to admit, off. Those views were worth it. Sure. It was worth losing a few house points for that detour. <laughs> you see yeah, me home on a house. broom. Bet if you had a fancy model, you could fly laps around Imelda. She's Kagawa's favorite. Molder. I could show her a thing or two if I had my own broom. Hate having to return the school broom after class. It's Perhaps I'll have to purchase a broom then. If you can, you should. Wish I could. Me too. I recommend visiting Albie Weeks at Spint Witches in Hogsmeade. That's the best name for a store. He's always looking to test new models. I'll keep Spint an eye Spint out for Witches. you in the sky. Go to Hogsmeade. That's somewhere I immediately have to be for some reason. Oh, the world may be ending, but listen. I need me a broom. Where is... Where is broom place? That's broom place? Yes. Give me the goods. Give them to me. I need to fly my broom. The freedom. Can you fly in the school? Because <laughs> that'd be a great way to get to class. <laughs> I'm so bad at remembering well, names. It's awful. How did you fare? I feel keen for some. <laughs> Dude, I just double practice. picked open that game. Me outside Don't. the defense oh. against the dark arts classroom. I know a discreet place near there. Sebastian, that seems a little like too much like flirting. Listen, I almost have a girlfriend. Is where we're supposed to go? <laughs> this is where we're supposed Please to go. Please meet me in the seventh floor <laughs> corridor as soon as you can. I have an idea for somewhere you can focus Wait. on your studies. Where Away from go? I got distracted. You're distracting me, Professor Weasley, right now. It's right here. I was not the right. Yeah, hold on. Go, go, go this way. <laughs> Excuse me. Is this, was this not the broom place? I'm so confused. Guys, I am losing it. There we are. Okay. Hit, hit there, hit there. Thank you, I need this. Okay, I can't, I can't map. Yeah. Yeah, see any rogue pots nearby? Let me know if you do. Ah, new face, wonderful. Um. Rebellion. Yeah. Run by the emerald Albie Weeks, this shop sells all manners of wizarding sports goods, including the latest broom models. Gossip around town is that Albie himself is working on a number of broom enhancements. Ooh. Will you improve the trim on my broom? There's a lot of secret things, and I'm gonna rob you real quick. Hope you don't mind. Um. Cool. How you doing, buddy? Hello. Mr. Weeks, is it? I love Albie your Weeks at your service. Welcome to Spin Witches. I yelled Apologies if you came by before and weren't able to come in. Shop's been closed since trade routes were disrupted. I had to travel as far as London to meet with my supplier. And I've only just returned, thankfully with inventory. I presume you're in the market for a new broom? Got a few rare U weavers Ooh. available. Ember Dash, Silver Arrows, Wind Wisps too. No matter what uh -huh. broom you choose, you'll be pleased. Kay. They're all exceptional, both in quality and performance. Which one is my style, you know? Sounds quite the array of brooms. I'll have a look around. Thank you. Thank you. Give me what your brooms. What are we looking for today? Like the most expensive broom there is. They're that all the same. Item is it the highest quality? Eh, is it really, does it really say me though? That's got a nice seat. Hold on, and a freaking lantern? That's, this is for exploring, you know? That's pretty swell. Uh, Hogwarts that house broom. The highest quality. Wow. Ember dash broom. Oh! 
Look at this. This is a sleigh. This is this is slaying. Let's check this guy. That again, item though. is no. of the highest quality. Okay, okay. So we, this has got nice seating. Oh, this is meant for travel too. Look at those travel bags. That item like is like a more industrial level quality. than this one. They're all of the highest quality, aren't they? Guys, the choices are just, just too many choices. I'm going with this one, obviously. It looks so You'll good. be thrilled with that broom. I, I know I will. You. Will you buy something for me? Like, all this stuff that I really don't, I really can't nice carry. Business with you. Have some new, oh, okay, I sold the glasses, but I can still look good with them, right? Hold on, did I just ruin something? Thanks for stopping by. Please tell me I sold my glasses. I do, broom will I do, be a okay. Step up from the practice brooms in Kagawa's class. They all have their limitations. Right, you seem to be a flyer who might be interested in, say, some enhancements. Uh. Go on. <laughs> yeah. uh, knew I was right about you. I think Go you'll on. be quite happy with the performance of any broom at lower altitudes. But you may notice that, that speed consistency tends to falter as you rise. I believe I can remedy this issue. I have some ideas for enchantments, upgrades, okay. if you will, that will improve the performance of any broom you fly. What I need is someone to conduct a broom flight and report back to me so I can perfect the upgrades. Sir, I'm a fifth year. As it happens, another Hogwarts student, Imelda Rays, is using abandoned broom courses for time trials. Clever girl. An ideal situation for collecting flight statistics. How many students if do you, you know? If you were to compete for the best time and succeed, then report back to me with how your broom behaved, I could complete sure. work on my first upgrade. What say? So I do time tests? That sounds <laughs> intriguing. I'll see what I can do. Thank you. It'll be worth your You're while. You're welcome. If I'm right, the new upgrade ought to enhance brooms in every regard. It ought to. And I can give you a special price. Okay. The time trial should be a bit of fun too. Go to the Quidditch pitch and Imelda Rays will sort you out. Well, if I like the Once idea. you've beaten Imelda's time, Imelda be sure to let me out. know. But I trust you. Completely. Now, can I just take off whenever I want? Because I really want to. I can't help but admire Mr. Weeks' enthusiasm. Yeah. I saw what you did. Ha! I have no tolerance for thieves. Hand them back. Hand what back, sir? But we've not took a thing. Hand them back. There's nothing to give, sir. It was only the one. Expelliarmus. Uh, I'm not all of them, sir. Honestly, I swear. How I'm... many times? Are you pair going to keep pilfering my shop? Can I, I pilfer your shop? Just those ones, sir. Promise, sir. We'd never take more than those. I tell you this, they'll not appreciate your antics in Azkaban. You just wait till I see your mother. Rebellion. That was cool. Zonko's joke shop. He seems funny. Frequently regulated, regularly, frequented regularly. I can read words, guys. By Hogwarts students and villagers alike, Zonkos is the place to buy pranks and jokes in Hogsmeade. Can I talk to him? Hey, man. I just want to say, I would never steal from you. Probably. <laughs> Those are so cool. I'm distracted. This is a cool place. I'm distracted. Listen, I came here to fly. Take me out of town. Hey, Seb. Can you fly anywhere? I don't even know, guys, to be honest. Hi. This leads outside. Sometimes it seems all roads lead to Hogsmeade. Ain't that so true? Is that a road? Is the train track? Uh. Hey, train track. <gasps> yes. Incendio. Nope, not what I meant to do. Press tab. Uh, that's a hold tab. Press tab. I I didn't read that. What'd you say? How do I get my broom? Uh. That was a mistake. And I don't have any health potions. <laughs> <laughs> Your journey has ended. That's it, guys. I lost the game. That's all she wrote. My dog wanted back in. Hmm. Oh! <laughs>
<laughs> Beep. <laughs> okay. How do I fly? Y'all? Okay, instructions. I need to know. Settings. Where's my controls? That's just that's an actual controller controls. How do I fly? Where's the control settings? For, for not that. Hold tab plus E. Oh, plus three. There he is, three. I found it. Okay, so it is hold tab. Ah, okay. <laughs> this is what I'm talking about. This is what I wanted, guys. This is all I wanted in this game. The exploration, what is happening over here? Yep, some fancy stuff happening. I don't want to do that right now, though. We'll deal with that later. I'm just here to explore. Nope, I'm here to hit a no-fly zone. That's what I'm here to do. And then I'm over here to explore. <laughs> this is so great. Abandoned long ago, no doubt. I'm just gonna casually do this all the time, you know? The bad guy over here somewhere? Where you at, bad guy? Ooh, it's a doggo. Some more baddos. You can't see me because I'm flying. You let things catch your eye too easily, my friend. You need a watch for that bird. That's funny. Okay, we can go now. That'd be fun. Julianne, I'd be down. <gasps> this is so lovely! Okay, so that's fast mode. It's all coming together. Birds. Oh my gosh, come on. <laughs> This is freaking magic. Alright, let's see this one. Let's see what's up your sleeve this time, Merlin. Let's do it. Was Merlin a Slytherin? Was it Merlin who scattered? Okay. Accio! Revelio! Levial fly? No. Acneo. Expelliant. Well, we got that whole light thing. So maybe we, oh, that's right. I have a, a wheel thing. How do I do that? Just boom. Yeah. Lumos. Nothing there. Well, what's going on over here? We got some sparkles. Revelio. That's just that's just the reflections deal. Okay. Ooh, maybe some of the blue sparkles. Accio. Maybe not. Don't you sass me. What else you got to say about that, huh? I didn't mean scare you. Lumos. Freaky. Frogs are cool. Revelio. Alrighty. Um. Accio. Repairer. No repairs here. Let's 
the prime time for a pair of. Maybe fire? Incendio. Lots of cool noises. Um. Let you so. Ha. Revelio. I don't know how to solve this puzzle right now. Probably whatever that gold thing is. No, that's probably just shrooms. That's where those bad guys were at. Aha! Uh -huh. Steal! I'm like a monkey. Oh, are you serious? <laughs> what the hell it is? Well, that's that's real dumb of me, eh? Yeah, I would have never gotten that. Play that much right now. What is, what's he on at me over there? Stop it. First try. <laughs> Thanks, Devin. Sorry, Julia. <laughs> I would have never gotten that. Maybe eventually. I would have still had these guys first, though. What are you guys all doing? Just chilling out here? Nothing better than a few pints of butter beer and a pile of mince pies with my sisters on Christmas Eve. Oh, that my sounds lovely. Delicious Yummy. I'm better than all of you. I can fly. Woohoo! <laughs> yeah, I'm a wizard. <laughs> Look at this handsome guy, man. He's letting his dreams come true. Listen, now I want to do this whole Quidditch thing. Like, forget main storyline. I got my broom now. I want to enhance it. Oh man, I haven't been here yet. This is so dope. Out, come on. Doesn't hit anything. Hey you, Hufflepuff. Uh, the name's Neil Baggins. Hey you, Slytherin. Sounds so good, does it? I'll be weak. Snake sent me. <laughs> Did he now? Still tinkering with his broom upgrade, no doubt. I tried to help him once. He nitpicked my flying technique, and that was the end of that. The nerve. Oh, fly better. Why is he roping you into his broom testing silliness? You've barely started flying from what I know. Caught wind of you showing off in flying class with Clopton. And she is a Slytherin, isn't she? Seems someone's jealous of my skills on a broom. Me, Slytherin <laughs> Quidditch captain, jealous yeah. of you. Yeah. Everyone knows that class is only for beginners. You're only for beginners. And bumbling baboons. But for some reason, now people think you're competition. Ugh, I can't be having that. Perhaps I am competition. No. You're not even Slytherin. Could be a useless squib for all I know. Enough of this. Only one way to find out who's the better flyer. By killing the other person. I hold one of the fastest times oh. on this course. Let's see if you can beat it. Okay. Slytherin versus Hufflepuff. Sure. With these glasses, I ain't scared at all. Actually, why not? I can beat your record. I'm so yes, looking I'm so forward lose. to seeing you lose. <laughs> Julianne, yeah, you are. <laughs> I'm sure you're not. The other guy is pretty cool, too. Alright, she's using that boost up and everything. Wait, oh, wait, no, wait. 
I did the wrong button. It's okay, we're good. Are these speed boosts? Is that what this is? Oh. Oh, I can definitely do better than what I've been doing. Oh, no! Oh. I'm going too fast. Too fast. There we go. Do it. Excellent. Good job. Good job, Baggins. Proud of you. The hobbit has a gun. Oh. Come on. Come on. Come on. Oh, no. Wee. Oh, snap, crackle, pop. I mentioned that I'm a wizard. Made it. The, the music in this game, though, guys. It's too good. Excellent. I think I'm gonna beat her time, I per se. Wow. <clears throat> I saw it. That was me right here. I saw it. No, Julian, don't go. <laughs> Wait. Uh, that's not. You, you must have cheated. You. I sure did. I hit the little yellow Fine. orb things that made me go won. faster. Don't think this is over. I do. You can't determine skill from one single trial. You're right, Surely Julian. my win means something. Terrible. Thank you. But you're still going to have to prove yourself if you okay. want to earn my respect. I don't want to earn your respect. <laughs> I was going to say that. I don't want respect from the likes of you. All you do is insult people. Burn. You and everyone else need to get a thicker skin. Anyway, I'm moving on to the next course. It's near Irondale and offers a much tougher challenge. Sick. You can try to prepare by racing this course again. Just check in at the podium where the leaderboard is. You can check your time and start the race. No. We'll see next time if your win here was more than just a fluke. Whilst on an errand for Alby Weeks. Uh, <laughs> it's all authentic. It's true. Uh, race leaderboard. I suspect Mr. Weeks will be glad to hear. I have to I've beat had. Ruby Wheel. Hold on. Hold on. Ruby Wheel is ahead of me? I don't know. Not today. Forgot how to play. Hold on. Can we restart that? <laughs> Take it. Gazed again. I messed up again. This Made a mistake. Fun. Okay, I keep getting out of fly. Here we go. Okay, now we're really gonna lose. Nope. Not hit shift. Shift is a bad button for you to hit, Neil. Okay, we gotta beat Ruby. Come on, Ruby. Success. Slow down. You didn't really want to win. I know you don't. No way I'm gonna win her. Man, she's so fast. Ah. It's alright. Get my practice in. <laughs> this is rather fun. This is rather fun. Cool. Alright, let's go do some, some missions. After I return to Albi, I guess. 
Um, I'll be the racist dragon. I'll be the racist dragon. Part six. Here's what it's like. It's a great song. <laughs> Suddenly, Albi wasn't racist anymore. Are we? <laughs> I much prefer hanging with Unias and Sevi. Thank you very much. Fire. Alright, where are we? Here. Scuzzy. I simply pretended that Me too. Oh, you're back! With I something am. to report, I hope. Possibly. I was able to set a record. Mr. Weeks, I was able to set a record on my broom. Incredible! Miss Ray's must have been shocked. She was. Tell me, how was the broom? A little turbulent, and it's wanting for a bit of speed, but it fared well enough. I will say that it tended to drift a bit to the left on certain turns. Heard a slight swoosh when I dipped. Adi, oh, this, she's thank a you. she's a Slytherin, mm. so that's precisely what I needed to, tell to you know. Why she's... <laughs> Drifted, eh? I shall get to work immediately. Even the naysayers okay. will be forced to admit that my works had potential all along. Is he going to make the Nimbus 3000? Why would anyone I'm doubt your ability to upgrade brooms? No, oh, you'd be surprised. People get set in their ways. Worry that fiddling with what's working fine will somehow ruin it. <sighs> Those people don't appreciate the sense of freedom that comes with quality broom flight. Nor sure. do they appreciate all that's involved in the creative process. I have a friend in Rome what runs a shop make? like mine. Says it's worse there. <laughs> of course, do they fruits? do nap in the afternoons from what I hear. And where would we be without enhancements? I mean, if Elliot Smevik had let the naysayers get to him, we would never have had the cushioning charm. I don't listen to him. <laughs> I'm excited to hear That's more. Really I have a very good <laughs> feeling about you this upgrade. I guarantee you'll be pleased. <laughs> Expect to hear from me soon. I will not. Hmm. I might. How to address the issue of altitude as it relates to speed? That's a great question. Maybe add more feathers. And if you don't have any feathers, maybe add some? Might blow your mind. Alrighty, let's look at our quest list, shall we? What do we got to do? What's going on? What's this? The old fool? That's neat. Okay, quests. We have in the shadow of the undercroft. All right, you want to meet me, and you want to meet me. Uh, room requirements. Okay, Professor Sharp's assignment. So, brother's keeper, last astrolobe, all the side missions and stuff. Let's do the room of requirement because Professor Weasley is cool. Uh, world map, please. Hogwarts map, please. Here, there we go. Um, is this the one I want? Yes. Yes. Yes! Dang it. Oh man. I always feel like guilty doing the mean things. <laughs> Like in any game that I play, it's really it's really hard to do, man. Hurts my tender soul. All right, it's too powerful for me. Did I go all the way up before? All right, Mr. Book, lead me to where I belong. I got a magic book. I got a magic book. Oh, thanks, magic book. Professor Weasley. Spooks. Hmm. Somewhere away from prying eyes. Ooh. I like how he's wearing just like a rug <laughs> as a <it> cape. <laughs> Forgive me, the headmaster stopped me and I... Merlin's beard. 
I see you've wasted no time. Well done. Thank you. <clears throat> Shall we? No. After it, you, it Professor. just opened. <laughs> She's so happy. I love her. <laughs> Yep. <laughs> the difference between a Hufflepuff and a Slytherin. Neil goes to hang out with the head professor. Jay goes to learn cool magic in her street today with the bad boy. <laughs> what is this place? This is the womb of requirement. Oh, it's true. <laughs> it only appears when one is in real need of it. I'm in real need of it. a student might stumble upon this room entirely by accident. Oh, if that sounds like ever. me. I'd only planned to suggest to you how to find it by walking past that little wall, focusing no, no, so on what you little... need. Oh, it, but you've managed to reveal the room on your own. Yes, I'm While a genius. I'm here, we should take advantage of the moment. Not me, Neil Baggins now, is a genius. Where is he? You leave all these pots unattended here? Dick, professor. The house elf I was speaking to in my classroom your last day. I thought you might help you use the room once you've found it. This is so dangerous, they're everywhere. This is the most scary. This is the scariest room I've ever seen before in my entire life. There's pots all over the freaking place. They're just sitting there. Theme pots. You don't know when they'll strike, okay? One almost killed me, Professor. You don't understand. There's no chance I'm clambering over this mess. A pot probably did this. This presents the perfect opportunity to teach you Evanesco, Sweet. the vanishing spell. Sweet. You can cast Evanesco to vanish certain objects, such as these chairs and other things here in the room. I suggest yes. you practice the wand movements first, then you can clear the chairs away. Sounds good, Professor. Okay. Spurs, 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 uh, First try. Pots episode two. <laughs> that is, yes. Now, cast Evanesco on those chairs. I don't think I wanna. Evanesco. Sure. Excellent work. Where does it go? You that you are now in possession of Moonstone. We shall discuss its uses later. Wait. Let's move on. Did I just convert it into Moonstone? Where in Merlin's name is that elf? Can I finish all the pots? Son of a... Dang it. Is that... I can put them all goodness. somewhere. Well, they won't hurt anybody My ever old again. school bag. I wondered where that had got to. I can't believe it's still here. I'll just take a quick look at this. Give you an opportunity to explore on your own until we locate Lumos. Yes, Professor. Come on, Mods. This way. Come here, Mods. <gasps> Dear me. Can't you keep it down? Some of us are trying to rest. Um, I really don't think I can. <gasps> Ooh, another one. Won't stop till we can. Um, I don't know why I did that. Go away. <laughs> uh, hey guys. Lumos. Can't see me now, loser. Oh, <gasps> that is so cool. <laughs> what? <laughs> Silly. Stop looking at me. So you're saying I need to do this to stop me from sliding down? Is that what we're doing here? I don't think that's going to work. What? I'm doing it back over here. Oh, this tea is delicious. Wow. Another Iron Maiden? There's so many. Should I try and climb it? 
<laughs> or can I do a hack Let and float? <gasps> yeah! Heck yeah, I'm a smart. Okay. Now what? <laughs> Revelio. Levioso. Akiem. That's fun. Revelio. So other things disappear. There you are. Bye. Hope this isn't as precarious as it looks. That seems pretty precarious. Stop them. No, not that's not helpful, you worthless pile of tin. Oh no. Are you okay? Revelio. Can I bring you back with the uh, Reparo? Reparo. Dang it. I just want to try all these new things. I just want to be a wizard, okay? <gasps> yes. They defended the room, thought I needed a bath, cheeky thing. That is pretty funny. Stone? What is that? Look at that awesome thing. Revelio. Uh, ooh. Is that a weeping angel? This seems ominous. How does anyone other than a house elf manage to get around in here? Uh, carefully. Who takes inventory? That'd be a pain. <gasps> so many instruments. Oof. What was that? It was a stitch. Was that a golden stitch? I hear it. Perhaps you should summon your wits and find out. <laughs> <laughs> You're funny. Revelio. Fit in there. Yeah, it's cool in here. Nope. That's just a uh, little room. <laughs> you guys have been saying things. Uh, the nurse who's so, so perky gave me sharp and going all day long because they had a push or silly brace act for good work. <laughs> no, he said it was a fetish. <laughs> oh boy. I hope that house elf can find us in here. Revelio. That's neat. Hold on. There's more secrets over here that I've yet to realize. So excuse me, storyline. I choose adventure. <laughs> Alright, fine. You can back through here. Please. And thank you. Oh, come on now. You can make that jump. Hmm. Is there a climbing adventure to be have somewhere? Can I break this? This is like, do I just gotta Let me look to you on top of the other box and then somehow reach it? What magic is this? Huh. 
Why not? Go away. Just kidding. I'm that wrong. <laughs> do, things, do things just fly forever? I guess I can make you float again, huh? Come on! Come on! I just want to open the chest! <laughs> hey! Wait, no, come back! Come back, over here. Over here, buddy. Come back, over here. Over here. Don't you run away. I don't think you're supposed to do that. <laughs> this way? Where'd you go? No, where'd you go? Ah! <laughs> Come back! What happened? Let me oh no! How did do that? <laughs> what happened? That was too much magic even for me. Come here. Right, there we go. There we go. I just want to open the chest. <laughs> Come here, sir. Come on. Come on. Come on, let's walk on there. We're doing so good. Let me go, Come on. Come on. Come on. I don't know how I'm doing this either, but I am. No! You're not the one I wanted! Hmm. I don't think I'm supposed to be up here. Dang it. Incendio! Expelliarmus. Fine, I'll go around. Probably. <laughs> I don't think I'm doing this the right way. <laughs> oh, man. Alright, storyline. Show us the way. <laughs> Just making chests fly, that's all. Excuse you. What is the house of? Ouch. Careful. Huh? Oh, there you are. Wait right there. Deke will come to you. Thanks, Deke. <clears throat> Hello. Ah, oh, Deke. We've been looking for you. Uh, apologies, Professor Weasley. Deke was looking through some of what's appeared in the room since Deke was last here. The Deke was right pillaging and rifling. Is this the student? Yes. Indeed it is. Deke is honored to meet you. Deke has been a friend since I was a second year. Wow. We discovered this room together. I mentioned you to Deke. We believe that you might be able to benefit from this room like I did. Deke, would you be so kind? Of course, Professor Weasley. Shall we? The room of requirement will always be equipped for the Seeker's needs. Cool. It's unplottable, so won't appear on any map. Most happen upon it by accident, if ever. Deep seen students in need of an extra file for potions stumble upon the room filled with them. Well, you seem to have accessed it in its form as the room of hidden things. Sounds I was like thinking me. about needing a place away from prying eyes. <laughs> Brilliant. Oh, that explains it then. What I need specifically is a place where I can catch up on my schoolwork without distraction. I just well study then, all. the room can provide you with precisely Isn't that. Isn't the library that? Now, it's time to focus on what you need. I need a million dollars. Just close your eyes. Two million. Imagine the room precisely as you need it. Hammocks everywhere. The room will do a the rest. A smoothie machine in the corner. Virtual reality. Abundant. Sandy beaches, maybe? Could be neat. <laughs> Magic! So this means I can never get that chest. Dang it. 
dang it! That's all I wanted! Million subs! <laughs> wow! Dude, Neil Baggins, way to be classy. You've given yourself quite a canvas to work with. This is like AI generation. <laughs> it's I like forward to seeing he doesn't deserve do any space. of that credit. The room ah, did all of that. And it seems the room has provided you with a desk of description. Excellent. It this can identify to describe things. <laughs> items of clothing. One should understand the effects of anything in which one is Sorry, was, there's a statue of a lady here. Woo! Sick. Hi, lady. How many extra brooms you got here? Everything's labeled and tagged. Werewolf. Werewolf. What? Are they all werewolf? Wow. That's a lot of... That's a lot of werewolf stuff. How many werewolves were here? Ma'am? Hello, Mr. Owl. How are you? It's good to see you. Ooh. That this is the coolest You'll book plenty of items in the world. Of that need to be identified. The desk will be an invaluable resource. There is a hole in the wall. <laughs> oh, that upsets me greatly. Nothing to identify. I know there is like that. I didn't think you fit a box through there though. Let's hmm. I'm upset. I imagine the desk of description will come in handy. <laughs> it will. I hope you'll take advantage of it. Probably. Now, I'll give you a brief lesson in conjuring. Okay. The room might not provide everything you need on its own. Conjuring? Yes. The magic of creating or conjuring. So we can objects. disappear things and I'll create things? You. Where do they go? The room of requirement? <laughs> Drink from the goblet. Very good. When conjuring more complex objects, oh. <laughs> you'll need what's called a spellcraft. <laughs> spellcrafts yes, are Julian, like I don't think like that. They okay. list the ingredients or resources. I think let's make it fly over everything. Let's not try to reach for it. Let's make it come to us. I'm a wizard. Okay. Are you sure that you're a real witch? I did. Where can I find the resources I need? <laughs> While resources such as moonstone can be obtained magic throughout means the highlands, laziness. Okay. it's much safer and If I have to go to, to a chest them, to open they it, they can also what be collected by I? vanishing objects in the room, such as the chairs you vanished earlier. In fact, you should have enough resources for now. Sure. I see. Can I regain resources by vanishing something I've already conjured? You oh, can indeed. So you use the conjure. Hmm. Cool. Quite perceptive. Why don't you give it a try? Go ahead and conjure the potions station and potting table. You should find both familiar since they'll resemble the ones you've already used okay. to study magical plots and brew potions in class. <laughs> uh, absolutely, that's totally true. On both accounts. Okay, um, you want me to conjure something, eh? Well, here we go. I pooped some things. Let's conjure some things. I would like, is there a bed or a hammock? That is so cool. What are, there's so many small gothic potions. A stylic botanical. Oh gosh, scientific seems fun. I like botanical. So, that is, so we get a house. We get to build a Sims house. I'm so thrilled. I don't need two of them. <gasps> Change the color. <laughs> this is so fun. <laughs> Look at it go. Okay, um, uh, boop. Back, I need herbology. And we are gonna make a match, of course. We'll just stick with yellow because that's a theme that we're going with. Um, I do want you over here. Because I feel like it makes sense, so we'll, we don't have to make it perfect. We'll just fit you in, like, right there. Well done. You can use these whenever you need to brew potions or grow plants. 
Sure. Presuming, Utility. Of you've collected any seeds or potions yeah, you need in Wall hangings. Or outside the castle Dang grounds. Rugs? Dang it. Furniture? Dang it. I got a bust. A puffskin statue. And the epitome of style. Good. Oh, this is costly moonstone, but I don't care. It's the only decoration we have. So we're using it. And look, I have a lot of moonstone, okay? I've been moonstoning it up. Deke will be here to answer any questions you may have. Do not underestimate his insights. <laughs> oh, I will be sure to speak with Deke if I need anything. Sure. Thank you. Good luck. I shall linger a bit longer in case you'd like to learn another transfiguration spell for use in the room. Sure. So hold on, let's use one of these tables and see what, what happens here. I want you. Okay, so you're saying I could do... A titney? I need a titney, please. So that's probably why you want multiple potions or stations. Okay. Listen, I need all of these. Can I like line up more than just one? Like, can I put like twelve in, in a batch? Have I get going? You know. We're definitely gonna make this part greenhouse. Can I expand to like new rooms? Is that what all these are for? Because that's interesting. Why are you all glowy? I'm ready for the next lesson, Professor. Teach me more, man. Very well. First, you'll need to gather some moonstone. Did it. You can acquire it by vanishing items here in the room of requirement, or you can gather it carefully outside of the Hogwarts grounds. Carefully. Return to me once you've gathered enough, and we shall be. Listen, begin I have lesson. so much moonstone. Let's go. I think we're good. I have the moonstone you requested. <laughs> yeah, I was gonna say. Good. I have the all then the moonstone. Then we may begin your lesson. You can conjure sure. more than potions and herbology tables. Okay. Conjuration can be used to decorate this space to your liking. Why don't you try it on the walls and floor? You want me to conjure something else? Okay. <gasps> A rug. Um. I know we have a red rug there, but that's okay. We can uh, make this work. Oh, it snaps. What? You're not inside a playable space. Listen, we're gonna make all of this rug land. Ruglandia. Ruglandia? Boom. Um, do, 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 ba do, ba do, do, what's this? More candelabras, okay. Don't care about those as much. I do need a good chair. And I do like the idea of a throne. You know, just one for me, no visitors. Where I can just sit here and watch people walk in. That's what I need. It's good for me. Um, and of course, with that throne, I need a table. I don't like how the table's bigger than my throne, but that's okay. We'll put two of them here just to just to intimidate people. That is not where that wants to go. Is backspace? There we go. You go here. Nope, <laughs> it's not where you need to go either. Listen, match with your brother. Thank you. Goodness. Perfect. Now then, <laughs> what colors can we do here? Uh, let's see. You. I like how we're debating about like the morality of having house elves in chat while I'm just having a blast decorating my room. <laughs> a dapper wizard, tell me more. Yes! No, no, that the fit perfectly. He's so dapper. So dapper, man. A bickering couple? That's a good piece of art. 
uh, a right next to a lady cooking nurse and baby portrait okay well that's perfect we're just gonna put art on that one wall and then ooh a long mirror that we'll put over here just so we can look at ourselves or not look at ourselves because reflections don't work in this game <laughs> whatever uh, are you done? Yes. Another one, please. Another! It is immoral. <laughs> Yet everyone's fine I have with some it? questions about conjuration. Yes? Uh -huh. I don't have any questions after Actually, all. Actually, I don't think I have any questions. <laughs> I'm here if you do. Okay. Now what? Can we leave? Oh, I need one more? Come on. I don't need another painting. I need another mirror. Put an oval one this time. Put it like really high too. There's no chance of anybody Good using one. it. Shall we move It'll on? Just be here. Just that, just just so just so you can question. Why is there a mirror that tall? Not only one, why is there three mirrors that tall? You know? Makes you wonder, why is there so many mirrors? This guy must be crazy. And one candelabra thing. I love that look, that's very, very fancy. <clears throat> I love how this room is slowly beginning to look like a, uh, like an old folks home. Hi. Or like an antiquity shop, you know? Hi, ma'am. I've conjured everything I can. What's next, Professor? I think Professor you're X. ready to take on alteration. Bye, the altering Boba. spell will allow you to customize Thank any you, sir, I will item. enjoy. You can change the colors, patterns, yes. and styles of your furniture to suit your taste. How about Let's the get size? started, shall we? Because I need a Watch bigger Watch closely <laughs> as I demonstrate how to perform the altering spell. Okay. Oh boy. Can I alter my wallet to have more cash? I would enjoy that. Just aim your wand at any conjured item and perform the altering spell to customize it. Alter the style of an item. Okay, you. Let's alter you. Uh, oh, we can change size. Oh my gosh, I didn't realize. <laughs> oh. Yep, that's what we're talking about. And you, we can change to make you even smaller. <laughs> Perfect. Okay, what did you so much but I do <laughs> oh man okay um also the style of an item <laughs> uh D. no wait back back three focus nope you three eerie confirm nicely done 
Dreadful. Now you're ready for something a little more advanced. You can use the altering spell directly on the room's architecture. Right. Try these new designs on the floor or balcony. Okay. <sighs> Get ahead of myself. Ooh. Okay. Now we're talking. I like this. This is great. Your space might benefit from a bit of ambiance, don't you think? No. Deep. Would you mind? Of course, Professor Weasley. Professor Weasley showed Deke this bit of magic some years ago. Deke thinks you'll enjoy it. Uh, come and talk to Deke when you're ready. Listen, I'm really busy right now. Oh, three. Uh, e. Love it. Shout out to Deke, I'm doing some construction right now. Oh man, I love this. Hi Deke! Are you eating food? Professor Weasley said I should ask you about changing the room's ambience. Give me some of music. Of course! Uh, what sort of overall look most appeals to you? Uh, ooh. Natural and earthy. Let's go natural and earthy. I'd like the room to feel natural and earthy as though I'm outdoors. Hmm, huh. sounds perfect. Magic. Ooh. Okay, so you just changed the shader back. I like that. Mm -hmm. Julianne, good night. Of course, you needn't keep this style if you don't like it. You can always ask Deke to change it back. Now you have learned a good bit about alteration. <laughs> Thank you, Professor. The room is full of possibilities. It is. Indeed. No matter how much time I spend here, the room always manages to surprise me. Neat. Ooh. That's cool. Wow. That's insane. Place is huge. An even bigger space. How did that happen? The room equips itself to your needs. It must have sensed that you needed more space to practice spell casting. That's so cool! If you'd like to customize the space further, you can use these spellcrafts. You'll find more of them both inside and outside the school. Okay. Thank you, Professor. I shall keep an eye out. Good. I'll leave you to it. This is your space now. <laughs> Use it wisely. I got my own room. That's freaking great. Most excellent. Sick. Oh man, this is great. Feel so dope. Okay, we can go. That's awesome. I wish I could sit in that. I'd like to ask you about changing the room's ambience. Of course. Uh, what sort of overall look most overall. appeals to you? Real estate simulator. <laughs> Never mind. Actually, perhaps another time. All right. Let us. Go talk to our friend. And then... Maybe call it up that. Want to learn some cool curse? <laughs> I love this. Okay. Um, cool. It's alright. <coughs> Quests. Meet Sebastian. Let's go, Seb. Buddy, old pal, old friend. 
doop a dap bit it boo track on discover food flames to unlock permanent blah 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 whole tab to inspect craft requirements for plants and potions and your tool wheel requirements are also listed in collections menu as well as potion stations and potting tables. Cool. Cool. Yeah. I'm coming! I'm on my way! For misery to happiness, uh huh. My friend. Ah, a rhinoceros skeleton. I'm on the right track. Yeah, you is. Mm. Over here. What's up, bro? Sebastian, it's been a while. It has. Glad you received my owl. I have something to show you. First, let me thank you for what you did in the library. Of course. Scribner tried to give me detention, but I have ways out of these things. Well, well you took the fall for me, and that counts for something. Did you find what you were looking for? I did, but something was missing. I'm not sure here is the best place to discuss it. Understood. We can talk more in a moment, Sweet. in the Undercroft. Sweet. Not even the professors know about this place. Cool. There's a basement. This way. There's a secret passage just here. It's all disguised. <laughs> Oh, this? Interesting. How did I know how to do that? How did you find this place? My friend, Ominous Gaunt. Ominous. He named it the Undercroft. We used to play gobstones here all the time. Somebody with a with my name. Sister. And like ominous. She loved that infernal game. What I wouldn't give to lose to her again. I should tell you, I swore to Ominous I would safeguard this place. Sure. So please, keep this between us. He never confides in anyone. But he's trusted me since the day we met. I wouldn't want to jeopardize that. We sure. used to sneak in here Revenge. daily. We've never been caught. Wow. What do you do down here? Like, drink? Because I would. Look at all these barrels. <gasps> oh! I just realized. Pots there are down here. There's so many pots. I think I got them all, actually. <gasps> oh! I can't spin that globe, and it saddens me greatly. Ah, yeah. Okay, how about you? Can I spin you? No? Dang it. Okay, we got... I think we got all the pots. Before Sebastian, we got all the pots. Everything is okay. <laughs> My gear slots are full. Dang it. We'll come back for you. I think I've seen ominous in potions. Or was it Herbology? I've noticed that he uses his wand to navigate the castle. He does. No idea how, though. Ominous was born blind, and no spell could reverse it. Way cool. His wand seems almost sentient. Not surprising, I suppose. Ollivander always Leon, says, hello. the wand chooses the wizard. Is that how he found this place? No, someone in his family knew about it. The Gaunts are full of secrets. Gaunts. I've never heard anyone else speak of it, and I've certainly never seen anyone else here. Again, mention this to no one, Kay. especially Ominous. He has no love lost for his family or their secrets, but this place is special to him. Understood. But why does Ominous have no love lost for his family? His father's family are direct descendants of Salazar Slytherin, Ooh. one of the four founders of Hogwarts. Michael. Obsessed with blood status, most of them. Ominous <clears throat> cannot abide them, as he'll be the first to tell you. Anyway. I like Ominous. The Undercroft has been a perfect place to sneak off to, away from prying eyes, and even practice otherwise forbidden spells. Really? Like what? Like <laughs> the Blasting Curse. <laughs> Professors say it's not an appropriate spell to teach students. That's ridiculous. A proper magical education ought to include all magic. My thoughts exactly. A spell like Confringo is only truly dangerous Confringo. in untrained hands. 
Such spells should be properly taught, not banned. To be fair, I'm admittedly partial to more fiery forms of magic, but you should learn it. Cool. I can teach it to you safely here. Hit me with it. I'm gonna learn it an evil spell. It may take a while to get the feel for it. Mimic my wand movement. The incantation is Confringo. Confringo. Very well. Okay. Woo! I'm a natural. You're getting it. Ready to actually try? Uh, no. There it is. Let's replace you. Akio, stick to the targets, though. Best to keep the undercroft intact. Have a go at those candelabras. Both have their uses. Couldn't bring up that nice work. How's it feel? It's a tad hot. You'll get used to it. That's it. I think I've got it. Well done. <laughs> Not him. I have to say, I enjoyed that. The first time Ominous and I practiced Confringo, we singed our eyebrows. <laughs> I would have paid to see that. I swore we'd never live it down. So this day, there's something about that spell that's addictive. Julian went to bed though. <laughs> this is exactly the type of magic I've been hoping to learn. <clears throat> There's more where that came Yay. from. Been practicing similar spells here for ages. Although, I didn't tell Anne and Ominous about every one. Haven't been here in some time. Mm. It's not the same without Anne. I'm sorry about your sister. If there's anything I can do. Perhaps when I next head to Felcroft, you could come along. Me, Tan. Sure. She could use some cheering up. I'd be glad to. Just let me know when and I'll meet you. Oh, she misses Hogwarts. She's been stuck at home with our guardian, Uncle Solomon. Uncle Solomon. Unfortunately, you'll have to meet him too. <laughs> meeting a new student will be precisely what she needs. I shall look forward to it. Let's Cheers. It. By the way, what was it you couldn't discuss out in the hall earlier? I'm not sure where to start. You said something was missing from what you found in the library. I assume it's to do with what you told me. About the port key and Gringotts and Ranrock. Nothing gets past you. And yes, it is. As I'm sure you suspect, there is a bit more to all of this. I'm listening. Bring it. Sure. You must promise to keep this between us. Please. I trusted you with knowledge of the secret undercroft. You can trust me. This is just me. manipulation, right. isn't it? Is he a bad guy? I can see traces of ancient magic. Ancient magic? I don't know what I was expecting you to say, but it wasn't that. What does that even mean? Honestly, I'm not entirely certain. All I know is that I can see whispers of an old magic that hardly anyone else can. Fig and I think that Ranrock has somehow found a way to harness that magic's power. Are you Weird. telling me that goblins may be wielding some sort of wizard magic? That's what we're trying to find out. And this ability of yours, does it allow you to wield this magic too? I... Uh, I don't know. Well, when you do know, tell me. I've been studying archaic forms of magic for ages. Perhaps we can help each other. In the meantime, with both Rookwood and Ranrock after you, I suspect a bit more time practicing the blasting curses in order. Spend as much time here as you'd like. And remember, keep this place between us. Tell everyone. When I head to Feldcroft, Rebellion. I'll send you an owl. Confringo! It's a Expelliarmus! Confringo! Levioso! <laughs> Accio! Lumos! Anyway, um... Off we go! Well, I think we're gonna end it there. After I exit this tower. Cause, uh, yeah, I am hungry and tired. Hello, Sebastian. Wait. Uh oh. You there? I can hear you. Uh oh. Uh -oh. Hello. Ominous, isn't it? I believe we have potions together. And herbology? I recognize that voice. Heard you talking to Gareth Weasley in potions class. 
You're the new fifth year. Did you just come from the Undercroft? How did you get in there? I'm gonna lie. That room's called the Undercroft. Ah, well, I was exploring and then suddenly found myself in a strange passageway. Don't lie to me. No one stumbles upon that room. Sebastian told you, didn't he? You breathe a word about this place to anyone. And not even your precious <laughs> Professor Fig will be able to help you. My father is friends with the headmaster. I am not afraid to exploit that connection if I need to. You needn't threaten me. I'm not going to say anything about your Undercroft. And Sebastian is a good friend. You shouldn't immediately assume the worst of him. I don't need you to tell me about my oldest friend. Thank you very much. You're welcome Ominous. very I just much. I know what you meant. Sebastian gets himself in enough trouble. He doesn't need your help. Fair enough. Can we be Sebastian friends? Sebastian is going to get an earful about this. You never saw me. <laughs> Can I listen to you yell at him? Dang it. <laughs> Alrighty, guys. I think we're gonna call it there. Goodbye, Mr. Rhinoceros. Ooh, a male. Hold on. Come and see me as soon as Dang you it. can. I've returned from a rather unproductive trip. Sorry, I got distracted. <laughs> what were you saying, sir? Hoping your time has been more fruitful than mine. Probably not. TBH. Anyway, guys, thanks for uh, joining us, me and Neil Baggins, on our adventures here today. Uh, I got a broom finally, and I'm so happy about that. <laughs> All right, I'm stop clicking to them. All right, uh, quick shout out to our top tier patrons: Gems to the Max, Mateo Mejia, and Corey. Uh, th thank you. So much for being a god. I would like to hear patrons you what Guardium what? Leviosa. Okay. It can be used to levitate objects for a short time. I have that. Once you've completed a few prerequisite tasks, do you have to Leviosa. I already have Leviosa. D don't I? Isn't that what Leviosa is? Is when Guardian Leviosa a different one? Lady, that doesn't make any sense. Anyway, good night, guys. <laughs> oh, I'm hungry.